Hello everyone, it's me PTAP again and we're back here in Satisfactory. Today I want to try to go over to the nitrogen which is up in this area and be able to bring it back and use it. So the first thing I'm going to do is come right here. I need to make a constructor right there and I'm gonna put a hole in the ground uh, like so and then I'm gonna pop down here and put a splitter on this line Which is the aluminum beats. Wait, let me make sure that's right. Might be just the ingot. Now that I think about it, it is. So. Oh, how do I want to do this? Do something. Oh, don't know if I'll be able to. I'm having a hard time. Bring a wait. What's this do? This is the main line. Does that ever stop? Probably not. No, because I have this set up perfectly. Well, dang. How do I want to do this? Just need a couple. These guys. Let's do smart splitters, I guess. Then I need a merger. Hoping I wouldn't have to do something crazy like this, but... Apparently... Just have much uh on making stuff like perfectly balanced and i don't really feel like making a whole new uh setup like this to make a couple uh iron bars or aluminum bars so i'm going to set it up like so And we're going to have the right side on this one be overflow. And then we'll do the same thing here, but with the left. So this might not be like super perfect, but hopefully it'll give me some aluminum. You know what I can do? Let's go ahead and find the odd man out. I don't think there is one. I'm going to turn off one of each of these machines. I'll just do that. And then that should definitely give me some aluminum. 
Yes. Alright, so. Now, I'm going to probably end up making it so uh, this all backs up, but that's alright. Alright, so now I need to bring this down. I need to bring that up. And then let's just connect those. And get rid of that splitter now. That's clipping a little bit, but I'm not going to worry about it. It's hidden. Up underneath. Alright, so now I have the proper aluminum ingots to make some fluid tanks. So let's put a organizer here, or storage. About like so. And I need to bring some power down here. And we can hook that up. And that can start making the uh, little bottles. Which I'll need in a second. Alright, so now transportation drone phase. Ah. That's the... Alright, so I'm just going to line these up. About like so. They're pretty big structures, so gotta have plenty of room for them. And this is where it gets interesting. So I need to set this out. So let's name this um uh, Nitro. And do these need power? Yeah. All right, so let's make sure these things have power. I'll have to fix this later. And then we'll name this one uh, Empty Hands. And I'm just taking a guess on this because I've never actually played around with these guys. And then we can make these guys. So I have two drones. This one's going to go get full nitro cans from where I'm going to be putting them and this one's going to be taking empty cans over there to be turned into full cans and then this is I wonder if this can oh cool all right so never mind I don't need one of these so let's get rid of that one Uh, that gave me back, yeah, okay, it gave me back the other drone. So this one's going to be, uh, Nitro Games. So, I just noticed that there's an outgoing and incoming, so I can have it take, uh, Nitro, or empty cans over and then bring back, uh, full cans. So, that works. Uh, what else do I need? I need to... Let's do this. And we'll run that line over here. And I'm just running it straight out of the main uh, area. So I know this thing's going to have batteries no matter what. Or it should, as long as my factories don't use all of them. But now this should have, yeah. 
going up to 200. And then I need to fun stuff. I don't know if I'm gonna. Hmm. See, I should look at this. It's 30. And that's 60. So let's lower this down to, uh, let's turn it back on and then lower it down to produce half of that. So do that. So that one's off. So that saves me 30 ingots. This one I turned down. Oh no, wait. It was at 40. So it was using 60. Yeah. Let's turn it back to 20. And then that saves 30 over here. So 30 and 30. Makes 60, which is how much I need for this guy. You'd be running all the time. And then let's do a merger. Yeah, there's plenty of room here. And we'll bring ah uh, auto save lag. Bring that up. And then let's do something. Oh, uh, like so. All right, so I want right to be any, middle to be none, left to be overflow. And we'll bring this up. About there. And hopefully this won't clip. All right, we're good. And then I just need to. So. This is going in. And we'll just bring this up here and connect it. I don't care. I'll have a little so this should be putting empty cans in here. Yes. How would I do this? Oh, uh, this port. Nitro can. All right, well. I'll have to figure that out later, but let's set up another uh, storage right here. And then when we bring cans back, they can go in there. And then I'll just set it up with us be able to go to the sink and stuff as well. But for now, I'm just going to have it go in there. And that should be this for now let me go and uh run that way and i have to take a line uh, electric line with me and i'll be back when i'm at the nitrogen so we're over here i made a little platform and then here is the nitrogen stuff which is uh interesting I need to put a resource well pressurizer. Connect that up to power. So then that should push stuff down and then make it so these can be mined. If I'm not mistaking. Oh cool. You can up that too. 
Oh, wow, okay. So let's put down some of these guys. Probably should make sure up here, here. That one's normal, that one's pure. So let's get rid of that one for now. So what if, this does 120. So, oh, it's shaky. Two forty. I need like five of these to make a six hundred line. I might as well go ahead and do that. Bam! One, two, three. These are pure. Yes. Alright. So for now. Oop. For now. I'm just going to put these over here. I don't know if I'll use them. All. But. Alright. Let's see here. Because I haven't even messed around and looked at this yet. These are little packager dudes. So to package nitrogen gas, 240 makes, er, 240 and it uses 60. So for right now, I'll probably just do, uh, two pipes. So let's go ahead and do something like, uh, logistics, stackable pipe. Something like that. Uh, there we go. And then I'll just hook that up. There. I'm going to put a... Connector there. And then take this one and connect it to that one. So then there should be 240 coming in here now. So, let's go ahead and bring that over here and put it in this machine. All like so. Then it needs empty cans as well, so... Let's go back here and set up... Another transport. Uh, where do I want to set it? This doesn't really matter. Let's just set it there. So I need the output here. Ah. Go to my normal settings and I'll do something like so. And this is, I'll just do that for now. So when it lands over here, it should output the empty cans to that, which then I can put into the machine. Then I have empty, and they'll be packing, and then I can send it back. And then I could just use splitters and mergers to make this more efficient and get all this stuff. Because I can do another two full ones, and then this one's a baby one. Let's see what this one actually even produces. 60. So, for now, I'll just do one, and we'll see how the production goes. 
and see if I need to do a lot more or if we're good. Now let's rename this guy to Nitro Gas Base. Alright, so now we have that set up. Uh, will that work? This port relevant ports. That is oh that nitro cans. Oh the Oh wait, that's the nitro base thing just did. No drones. Okay, so I guess I need to go to the other base and then set this up as well. The status. Oh, wait. Ooh. All right, so he's here. So he should be dropping off hands, hopefully. I like how you can actually set it up from this one to send the drone over, though. Yeah, he dropped a package, so hopefully that's cans. Yep. So now... Next time, you'll be able to take the packaged nitrogen gas back. Alright, so this should work nicely then. And then, depending on how many, or how much nitrogen I need, it'll be dependent on how big I make this over here. But I have enough to make Two more, or yeah, two more of these, and then another one that's underclocked. So, and then I think you can actually, uh, yeah, you can overpower these two or overclock them. Nice, all right, got the drones figured out and up and running. I don't, I'm not going to be putting any batteries over here because it should be getting all the batteries it needs, hopefully, from over there. But surely it won't use 200 batteries flying back and forth in one trip. But, alright. Hopefully you guys have enjoyed uh, me getting the nitro gas and figuring this little bit out. But, yeah, you need this to be able to unlock uh, or be able to make uh, one of the items, forget which one it is, but you need it, you need it to do the here unlock, so that way you can get the other piece you need to get the other tier unlocked to do the clean nuclear power stuff, so that's the reason I needed to get Nitro. So, hopefully you guys have enjoyed this video, and I hope to see you in the next one.